Bro, move, bro, 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 move, bro, move, bro. Back in the Hogwarts, you gotta go, gotta go meet Professor, Professor Weasley. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Bro, why she keep trying to get the truth on me, bro? You know I'm gonna keep lying. Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. I'm not sure I have time for extra assignments, Professor. You shall find the time. You'd be astonished to know just how much you don't know. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Bro, I ain't got a lot to you. I'm ready to get to the action, bro. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very you feel well. me? I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Oh, oh yeah, you already know who I'm Sebastian picking. Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. You feel me? You know what I'm, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to see you hurt. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. She's talking about a butterbeer, ma'am. I don't think I'm the age for that. I don't... I bet, 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 bet. I know y'all see the new gym. I ain't say nothing about it, but I know you see it. What are you up to now? Stylish. I'm trying to tell you. Well, look at that. I don't even know what color that is. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do. And an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up. Makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Ropero in no time. I bet. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Yeah, I don't, really, I don't really care if you're doing too much talking. I'm just trying to get straight to the action, bro. Just like, teach me, bro. You know what I mean? This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Oh, yeah. Seen that? Hold on, do I gotta get on top? Hold on, wait. wait. Keep moving. Keep moving. Wait. Bro, keep moving. Hey, I got him. I got him. There you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, where's that? Oh, yeah, there you go. Brilliant. That was it. Oh yeah, I'm like, I'm like, top of the class, huh? I trust the preliminary tasks weren't too. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. 
Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit is too of easy. your magic. Don't worry, Professor, I got it. I just realized that was a different button. I almost messed it up. You feel me? Alright, look, I'm not gonna lie. I thought it was the other girl. I thought, I thought, it, was, I thought it was Nelly, not Nelly. <laughs> That's on me. But, I mean, she cool too, though. I ain't no problem with her. I just thought she was the other girl. My fault. Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Oh, this kind of really? nice. Yes, I had planned to extend an invitation to you. Now, how I get that? I thought you might enjoy a better be in the room. Oh, I think she got the kill bit. Oh, that's the. Uh, the timing of Professor Weasley's hour was perfect. These robes on point, and I still my fault. Oh, what's so special about them? They are interesting to look at. But if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Was that goose? Geese? What is this? Why am I so violent? What am I doing? Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, huh? Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss On I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. Moon? Jemmy, guys, Dudley and Airy, and mm, terrifying. Yes, that perk thirty oh, kicking in. Yeah, she'll be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Poor Mr. Moon. A Debbie, guys. I think he had too much fun in the village. Tell me I will perks. say that I have never seen him in such a state. Nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank yeah, you. yeah, me, you, and the, and the other girl, because I'm trying to see where she at. I ain't talked to her since the first day. And now we in the we city? Are. It hold is on. hard to know where hold to on, start. Hold on, hold on. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter beer. I don't even like cats for real. And you can real. get any sweet you oh, can imagine curious. at Honey Juice. You know dogs? I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. Well, what are they playing? What are they eating? That corn? And the sausage? Man, where the burgers at? Oh, no, nah, they ain't got no good eats. Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spellcrafts, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Enjoy yourself. I will see you soon. What's a bet? No, I'm not coming back. <laughs> they ain't finna see me until about a couple days. <laughs> I'm finna explore everything, everywhere. I got the barber shop? Hold on. I get in. I get in. That's the spot, huh? Okay, okay. Y'all got in stock. Uh, oh, we ain't gonna talk, bro. What y'all got in? Bro, can I? Can I get close? I'm gonna go to the back then. I don't care. Like. I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Ah, uh, hello, sir. I'm looking for for a new wand. Yes, it's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? 
Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Hmm. Uh, no, 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 not you. Um. Ah, yes. Yes. Hmm. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches. Hmm. You might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um. We'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. I don't know. I, I think I kind of like the first one better now. A little iffy. Yeah, see, look, I already knew that was going to happen. Mm -hmm. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Come on, what it look? Oh, I got to customize it, bro. Hold on, bro. Just got to stick off the ground. Like, what is this, bro? Like, I do I really get the custom? Hold on, my fault, my fault. Bro. <laughs> I say, ain't no way, bro. Just gave me a stick off the ground, bro. Like, what's going on? I only got the different variations. Hold on. All right, so we got this one. Trash. How intriguing. This one, the classic gray, ain't that? You know what I'm saying? Okay, okay. A little spiral. A little honey dip. The one. Curious indeed. I ain't gonna lie, I like the smooth one though. The classic. You feel me? The black. Big brown. How intriguing. How intriguing. Well, how am I supposed to know what this look like? Like. Like, could I change this afterwards or no? How am I supposed to know what this look like? Bro, I don't know, know how I'm going to tell the difference between any of this. We'll do some consistent magic. Okay. Great range of magic. Okay, okay. Do some powerful magic. A dragon heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. I need that. Hopefully I can change it later if I don't like what it. What do you think? Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah. Yeah. Now it's drippy. How did it's drippy, that feel? real drippy. Good. Different. I sense the sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. All right, bro, bro, appreciate you for the wine. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. 
It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? I ain't gonna lie. Ain't lie. I'm not even gonna lie. Bro is just chatting, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, okay, I get it for surely. You feel me? Now I just need to see, you know, what, what I need to cook up. Oh, I'm glad it's free because I'm not gonna pay for this. Mm -hmm. Feel Appreciate free to you. take a look at the rest of my inventory or come back another time if you're in a rush today. So, honey, do you think, bro? I came from. The hoods of Wesley Waverly Place, bro. Hogwarts price is different. It's their private school money. I ain't, I ain't got that. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way, and this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But... What say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let me guess, you're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Plenty nah, of nah, ingredients nah, nah, to nah, pick nah, your nah. interest, I'd <laughs> wager. Now with them prices, I ain't looking nowhere. Bro, I'm trying to get some of that drip, bro. That's that Quidditch drip, bro. I need that, bro. Say big dog, let me get that, let me get that, let me get that robe off you, though. Like, not, not like that, but you know, like, let me... Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson, then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest. Creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Mm-hmm, appreciate you, aunt. Need all that. If you're sure. interested, mm, that, feel nope, free to mm, take mm, a look no, no, at mm, the mm. rest of my infantry. No, I'm straight, bro. Appreciate you, though. Ah, I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Oh, 
know what they Oh now we gotta go. Mm-mm. 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 Yeah, he eating them. We gotta go. Mm-hmm. I just gotta act tough in front of her, that's all that matters. <laughs> I'm finna die. I even run the ones? We can run the ones then. Hold on. Hold on, watch. Hold on, I ain't. Watch the combat. Watch the combat. Tried it. Come on now. Wait, yo, you see the. You see the. You see the. Nah, he too big for all that. I don't know why I thought I can pick him up. Yeah, I, I, that, that was the wrong move, wasn't it? So, bro, get back, bro. <laughs> oh yeah, oh, oh, oh Lord, she dying, she dying. Yeah, she done though. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, he kissing all these, bro, he, bro, bro. I'm pressing the wrong. I'm finna die. I don't know some new stuff. Oh yeah. Okay, back to back. Okay, we, we right, we right. We straight, we straight, we straight. We straight, we straight. I'm dying. I'm straight. I'm straight. I'm dying. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Bro. Well, pop the, pop the, pop the something. Bro. Bro. Bro, I'm in, I'm in a corner. I'm in a corner. I'm stuck. Ain't your magic. Move. Weave. Weave, weave, come on. Told you when I weave, when I get right. Okay, what are you doing? Oh, I know what to do. My fault. Oh, do it again. So I can, so I can block it. There you go. Yeah. Bitch, how to get on one. Hey, get back. Ooh, what the, ooh, what this is? Ah! Oh, no, <laughs> <I'll go. laughs> nah, that was clean. Goodness, a second troll. <laughs> you feel Did me? Did you two take on a fully grown troll? It, it was all me. By yourself? It was all me. I suppose so. You feel me? It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that? The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer. officer. Singer. And thank you, again. Officer, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't know that I was 12. Hold on, hold on. Oh yeah, I got this, I got this, uh, um, oh. Uh, you feel me? Know what I'm saying? Cleaning up the city after a good little fight too. Lucky they didn't do more damage. Nah, that move was crazy. I don't know who I was feeling like. So like. Like, you know what I'm saying? I ain't got no problem with helping, but, like, I'm, I'm getting paid for this, right? Oh! I mean, it's, just a, it's a lot of, it's a lot of kid labor going on here. I'm just, just little one, just one. I'm just wondering, bro. I'm trying to get a little something. You know what I'm saying? How the cat survive? Oh, yeah. Oh, this is exactly what I wanted to be. Oh, yes, sir. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself. Augustus Hill. Clothier extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. 
And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. <laughs> What do you think I am? <laughs> I need all that. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very Dang generous God. of you. You got no it's clothes and no bread. Can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. So, like, so, like, what are what are rest of the fits at though? Like, what an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butterbeer. Shall we head to the three broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way then. What if I can steal out of here? Like, I'm just saying, you got a lot of st stuff in here. This chest? I need that. Uh huh. Uh huh. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, preach. What is this? What do I do with this? Akio. But what what do I do with this? I want it. Lumos. Hot. Can, can I take it? Alright, bro. I'm gonna come back later for it, bro. Are you? You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. <sighs> Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say, trolls in Hogsmeade, that's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <coughs> Not timely. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. Are you trying to pull out the strap on us? Where I was going? Theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the ominous. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Bro, ain't nobody scared of y'all, bro. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Both Ranrock and Rookwood. 
What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything, but it's perhaps best I do that later. I like, think that dang, now bro. might be a good time to head back to the castle. It's like, bro, it's like my second day at school. I got ops. You feel me? Over here fighting giant trolls in the city. You feel me? Ain't even getting nothing to eat yet. It's crazy out here. I am certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. 